Hi, welcome back to ODE YouTube channel. Today I have here another unboxing for you. This one is a really exciting one. At least that's what I think. So this pen came from the United Kingdom. And let's open it with the yellow Victorinox knife because it is a yellowish pen. Let's open it like this. So this pen was sent, it went to the to the costumes, and now here it is. There is a letter inside. Let me just take a look here. And now let me see the pen that I have. So this pen is a pen, the a pen by William Shakur in the United Kingdom, and he made this new product. This new product is really, really interesting at least as far as I know. This is a pen I bought from him at a very good discount, I would say, and it is really kind of a unique pen. Just before I show you this, I have here the William Shakur Titan, which is the, the one that I already have, which has a number eight titanium nib, and it is a 3D printed pen. And what you have here is another 3D printed pen. So let's take a look. We open this good protective case and here we have the pen. And let's take a look. What we have here is a very interesting thing. This pen is made of yellow resin and has, far as he told me, it is cured epoxy resin, UV cured epoxy resin, and this is a pocket pen. And it's quite amazing because it is a number 8 pocket pen, a number 8 nib pocket pen, so that's kind of great. It's, it's, I think this, this is a really interesting design because you're not used to see such a big nib. And just let me show you how these look, it has some marks, which I think they are from the 3D printing process, like some of these lines there inside. Let me just show you the idea. I think this is really, this is really, really an interesting one. I am, I'm really curious about this. So let me show you. First we have the, this kind of concept, I think you know, and it is close to a Caveco Sport. And I have here yellow ice sport, which is also transparent. This is more translucent. I should have brought the frosted sport. This line, however, is very marked. I hope this is not a crack there, it's just a mark. But I will talk to him about this. So, this pen is the Cavex Sport. It has almost the same size, the same kind of design, but it has a number 5 nib. So, and the nib is quite small. Then we have the Gravitas Pocket, which is, let me post this one, which is also short pen, pocket pen, but it has a much bigger section and it has a number 6 nib, and overall the pen is larger, but the design is, over, is kind of the same, it doesn't have the facets on the cap, it is a little bigger, but with a much bigger nib. And this William Shakur Titan Pocket is a little bigger than the Gravitas, but with a much bigger nib. And this is a fun thing. So you can see it goes there close to the top of the cap, but not 
that close that is dangerously, dangerously close. And this is a pocket pen. The other interesting thing is that this pocket pen is... Yes, it is a piston filler. And that part is also really, really nice. So, I'm really interested in trying this pen. I think this design is kind of uh, a real good upgrade. I'm not 100% sure if I feel comfortable to have a um, piston-filled pen in my pocket to use as a pocket pen, but it's really, really a fun one. I, th I think this is a very nice design. I'm just looking at those things. If they are machining marks, I don't have any problem. If they are developing cracks, maybe I should have some problem. But we'll see. There will be no... William is a great guy and we talk with him and there will be no problem, I'm sure about that. Um, he, he makes great pens. He is now creating lots of different models with this new kind of 3D printed resin and if you want a pen like this you just need to to send him a message through his Instagram I will leave his Instagram on the description of the video so you can contact him I think this pen is really really interesting I will uh, ink it soon and start to write with it and give you my feedback. So let's take just a look at here. The nibs are the same. Both are titanium nibs, number eight, fine nibs. This has more kind of a yellowish, more goldish uh, circle there, and this this one is not goldish. And there is. Something that is also interesting is that the, the section of this one is a little thinner than this. So I think this will be easier to fit in some filling system. So I, I don't think there will be any problem of filling this one from the Visconti Traveling Inkwell, which is a very nice way to have a very good feel of a piston filling pen. So. I, I know that my voice may not say everything that I am feeling about this pen, but I'm really, really excited to see how this little pen works, because this is just, just fun to have such a small pen in terms of size, uh, but big in terms of girth and also in the in the size of the nib, so it's it's very interesting. I like, I really like this design. I really like this. And if you want me to make a video about pocket pens, maybe it's time to make one. I have several, and there are several different design approach for them, so I can maybe I, maybe it will be interesting. Please let me know if you want such a video. So, if you are interested in this pen, give him, send him a message over Instagram. He, he always has lots of pens in order, but he, he will talk back to you and it's very easy to communicate with him. I am really, really excited to see this pen and I need to ink it soon to see how it works. Sorry, I'm just <laughs> saying the same thing over and over again. So this is all for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you liked the design of this short but very interesting pen and I'll be back soon for more videos and I will of course review this one someday soon. So this is all. I hope you enjoyed and we'll meet again. Bye.